everybody, it is I, Lainey Bliss. I am back with another re reaction video. It's a Patreon request from Game Act 3, and you guessed it, it's gonna be, uh... Oh, it's not actually a, um, uh, Try Not to Lap Challenge, but it's more like a, um, a funny, um... Uh, most funniest, stupidest answers on game shows again. So we're just going to have some fun with this. It's a long video, so I, I think I want to just get started and off we go. In three, two, one, go. Green. Miners and hoes. No. <laughs> Time starts now. A group of pill pushers? <laughs> <laughs> they allowed this stuff back then? Okay. I'm surprised they didn't believe some of this out. Event is our category. It's worth $1,000. Greg, uh, an ace of kidneys. <laughs> an ace of... How long what? have you been George here? Seven years. Yeah, now, now you are signing, I notice, and that, what does that tell us? That means he's deaf. <laughs> <laughs> Child? Now, you are a school counselor. Yeah. Ask a dumb question, get a dumb answer. This term for a long-handled gardening tool can also mean an immoral pleasure seeker. Ken. What's a hoe? No. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> they teach you that in school in Utah, huh? Al, what's a rake? A rake is right. Wow. Ed Tessman, Helen Alving, Newt Brovik. Who are three people who have never been in my kitchen? I don't know. <laughs> okay. O oh, is the generic word for any living animal or plant, including bacteria and viruses. Orgasm. Oh. Or organism. Organism. Golly. Oh, that's there, embarrassing. There are reasons. There are reasons which I won't go into that I can't accept that particular. Right, players, tell me what type of vehicles are used to compete in the legendary Tour de France? Alan again. Uh, uh, SUVs. Ferraris! Name? You and I know this. A specific part of the body that women try to accentuate. Same. Rest. I'm, I'm, I'm glad she would, she rolled with it. I mean, they, they clearly are the cool. part of the body that gets bigger as adults get older. Freddy, penis. <laughs> what would be the ideal everyday temperature? Everybody, disrobe. What? 98.6. Survey said... She's like, I want to go now. Like living on the Aquita. <laughs> Name a kind of bear. Carmen. Where's papa the bear? bear? A papa bear. Of course. Only a papa oh, bear. Oh my god. Name something normally worn only by children. Michael. Clothes. <laughs> only children wear clothes. Yeah, I'm a child, well, guys. You might accidentally leave on all night. Yes. Your shoes. How about contact lenses? Well, you don't take this the wrong way, Kenneth, but you are weird. Yeah. <laughs> Got a boyfriend? I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> hey -oh. I was just trying to get off the subject of schools. <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> Michael. I for for forgive me. A girlfriend? Have you got a girlfriend? No, I'm gay. <laughs> hey -o. Hey -o. <laughs> That's called a gotcha. <laughs> or a send back. I'm a very happy little fella myself, actually. Name <laughs> something you feel before you buy it. Mike! Excited. Feel when you before you buy it. How about a tomato? Knighting. The queen slipped with her sword, so instead of being knighted, Sir Irving was blanked. Uh, bar mitzvah. <laughs> uh. Being married to a girl 
drill sergeant has his drawbacks. Every time we make love, he expects me to clean his weapon. <laughs> Now, we welcome you and ask you to tell us about yourself. I live in Orange County. I'm retired. I mean, retired. Oh, honey. Oh, honey. She needs a hug. The country has the highest ratio of doctors to population. The country with the most Jews? <laughs> I would say Israel. You have a doctor in every family. It's a cousin. Could be an uncle. Couple of specialists. I'll agree. You agree with that? It's Israel. He's right. It is? <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. Joni, you're watching balls go back and forth at speeds of up to 160 miles an hour. In what sport? <laughs> John. Jogging. <laughs> When a man falls out of your boat and into the water, you should yell, man overboard. Now, what should you yell if a woman falls overboard? Full speed ahead. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's funny. That's funny. <laughs> what should you do about a hairy back? Uh, I usually close my eyes and imagine she's wearing an alpaca sweater. <laughs> organization ends by stating that its members are brave, clean, and reverent. Alcoholics Anonymous. Boy Scouts. <laughs> Which letter of the alphabet sounds exactly the same as a term for a female sheep? Bah. Huh? Is that English? I didn't even understand that. You? <laughs> Never mind. Will your husband say he is uh, basically more urban or rural, Kathy? I don't know what they mean. <laughs> oh, good, good. Well, you know him. Uh, I mean, you married him. What do you think? Uh, uh, heck, he's urban. He's urban? <laughs> yeah. How long has he been that way? <laughs> About two months. Two months he's been. <laughs> oh, is this why blogs get a bad reputation? Do you, do you think there's anything he can do about it? He went to a doctor. Oh, he did. <laughs> okay, now he's just messing with her. This is just mean. This is just cruel at this point. Did, did uh, the doctor give him anything for Stop talking. He gave me something. Gave Stop talking. <laughs> what do your husband say is his favorite condiment? Oh, I would say his pool table upstairs, definitely. <laughs> What? Annette? I, I never heard that word before, neither, so I said karate school. How many decades will your husband say his mother has lived? Gloria? Ten decades. Ten decades. <laughs> Gentlemen, how many decades has your mother lived? Daryl, you have a troubled look on your face. What's the matter? Oh, I don't know what a decade is. <laughs> 44th birthday, so she'd be good. It's four years a decade. She'd be 10 decades. 10 decades. <laughs> Gentlemen, what is the very last traditional Jewish favorite your wife prepared for you? Jewish? Yeah. Hurry with your answer. Chow me. Chow me! <laughs> yes. Um, corn. Corn. Chow. Okay, he, he said that it's uh, just the top card, Rick, is really all I need this time, I think, is a bagels, he said. Bagels? Yes. What are bagels? <laughs> you can go ahead and tell her, Rick, what are bagels? I don't know, I'm Mormon. <laughs> well, tell me, okay, what is I'm your done. favorite crustacean? Okay, I am so done. I'm going to stop. This is just <laughs> bad. How, how much? Right, Laurie okay, said my favorite we're is, almost uh, 10 minutes in. in. Eyes. Oh, some of these are, like, really bad. Like, I'm laughing, but they're bad. <laughs> Lobster? Like, these, these can't be real. Right. These aren't real people, are they? It's like, are you wiping away? I mean, why? What's the one thing you would hate to hear your wife say about your last girlfriend on Coast to Coast Television? She said your last girlfriend was a hooker. Oh, <laughs>
Oh, that's Venom. <laughs> Will your husband say is his very favorite kind of rodent, Georgie? It's a rodent. His very. <laughs> What's a... Oh, my! I, I'm a rat owner and I'm cringing right now. His saxophone. <laughs> okay, I don't want to live on this planet anymore. That's just bad. Next question, gentlemen. What is the one thing the people on the other side of your street have more of than you do? Cars. Cars. Your wife said they have more, more grass than you do. Grass. What well, have you done? I wouldn't bet on that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Gentlemen, what Spanish word or phrase will your wife say best describes her bust? Jimmy. Nada. <laughs> Roses are red, violets are blue. On our wedding night, my husband, what? We went to bed. <laughs> well, he's direct. What country will your husband say the last foreign car he rode in was manufactured, friend? The United States. That's not a foreign country. That's... Um, Texas. Texas! <laughs> Hey, and Texas is a poor country, guys. Thing to squeeze in the supermarket. Jane? I'd say his meat. Pardon me? His meat. What? Right. I missed the question, so what? He's a butcher. Oh. <laughs> I don't, you know, I don't want to know. The one product name that best described your romantic behavior on your wedding night. Oh. I would say uh, Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pepper! <laughs> <laughs> okay, she said you're the jolly green giant. <laughs> I'm sorry, but it was... I'm not that big, Karen. <laughs> Five-point questions. Girls, tell me where specifically is the weirdest place that you personally, girls, have ever gotten the urge to make whoopee? Olga? <laughs> I don't want to answer this. I don't even understand the. I, whoop the. What? Oh. I just. I can't. Not even with this one. Oh. Are we done yet? Please tell me we're done. Oh. Not yet. Uh. Oh. That's strange. We got a full black screen here. Oh, okay, so we have like a full minute of black screen. Okay, then. Um, yeah. I have no words. Um, people back then were crazy. <laughs> and I truly hope this recorded, otherwise I'm in trouble. Um, but yeah. <laughs> wow. Uh, no words. People are crazy back then, and I'm kind of glad that I wasn't around for those years. I mean, that looked like that was taking place in the 70s and the 80s and early 90s. I was born in 1986, so it's very possible some of those shows were airing when I was little, but <laughs> luckily I wasn't old enough to watch them or care enough to see them. So, wow. What is a rodent? Are you serious? I can, I can name rodents mouse, rat, capybara gerbil, hamster, guinea pig, rabbit. Those are rodents. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this reaction video. Game act. I don't like you right now. Stop making me watch these. <laughs> Some of these are just worthy of my brain being fried over because of the sheer stupidity. Um, Bless their little hearts. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Keep an eye out for those rainbows. They will make you smile. And once again, this is a special shout out to all my Patreons who supported me back in November of 2019. A big, big thank you goes out to Side Steel Rail, Bryce Aarons, Drivel, GameAct3, Reactor Akor, Zion Craze, Arctic Wing, Cliff, Kimberly Cook, Jaquito Valentine, Rasputin Lennon, Thomas Fan 2751, Night Mist, Color Scales, Ripple Effect MLP, Joshua A. Starrett, The Watchful Pony, Blaze Armor, Hearts Bloom, Jeffrey Ritter, Twilight Sparkle Fan, 
Aragon, Nightshade, Blaze, Thundernote, Lycan, Luigi Man 87, Walker Ironheart, Peter Scholl, Josh Scorcher, and Jarog 1989. Again, guys, thank you so much for all your support, love, and just sticking with me throughout this entire year. And it is almost Christmas time. Woohoo! So I look forward to making more shout outs. And if any of you are interested in getting a shout out or other Patreon rewards you'd be interested in, be sure to check out my Patreon in the links below. Take care and keep an eye out for those rainbows. They will make you smile.